I got a, uh, an email today and it asked me what BioS3 training meant, what the BioS3 in the BioS3 training meant. And then I realized that it says it on my blog, but it doesn't say it on YouTube, and it would be easier for me to get the point across if I just explained it. So the BioS3 stands for Biosynthetic 3. Okay, Biosynthesis is the creation of living tissue, muscle tissue. And I use, everybody uses three things to get that to happen. You have diet, training, and cardio. Okay, you have those three things. Now, there's also three parts in the diet. Proteins, fats, and carbohydrates. So all those things are, you know, part of the three that's in BioS3. Also, the training program that I use, I usually use three sets. Um, the first set is kind of like a feel set. The second set is to failure, and the last set is to failure. And I usually feel the fourth set is overkill. So I found that over time, three sets was a pretty good number to keep on. So that was another part of the three. And there's also three ranges of motion a lot of times that I'll use. There's the mid-range, which would be a compound movement, a uh, stretch movement, which would be, let's say, an incline dumbbell curl, seated incline dumbbell curl, and then a contracted movement, which would be, let's say, concentration curls or cable curls. So there's three ranges of motion. So that's the three inside the BioS3. Now, BioS3 is not my way. It's not a program that I invented. BioS3 is, well, let me explain it like this. There was a great martial artist that everyone knows, famous. His name was Bruce Lee. And Bruce found out that there were different parts of different martial arts that worked really well, but there were other parts of the martial arts that didn't work. So what he did was start combining martial arts and taking the best of parts, and he made his own art called Jeet Kune Do. This is the same thing that I did with BioS3. What I do is I take every program known to mankind, Everyone. It doesn't matter what it is. If it works, we use it. And that's what BioS3. It's not its own program. It's every collective program together. Which means that I use keto diets. I use high carb diets. I use moderate carbs. I use carb cycling, intermittent fasting, fasting, whatever. Liquid diets, it doesn't matter. If we have to use it to get the job done, that's what we do. We may use drop sets, power lifting, you know, 1 to 3 reps, 15 reps, 50 reps, whatever. We may use steady state cardio. We may use intervals. We may use double splits, we, anything, it doesn't matter, plyos, it doesn't matter, we use it all. So when you have someone that wouldn't respond to a certain program, let's say you were doing a moderate 10 to 12 rep range program, they're not responding to it, well, I'm not going to say, keep going, this is my program, do it my way. We just simply scrap it and move on to something until we find what does work. So that's the whole thing behind BioS3. You have the, the cardio program, the diet, and the training, and out of all that stuff, we use every single program and technique known to mankind that have ever been invented to get you to your goal. So I hope this explains what BioS3 is, and, I, and it kind of gives you a little more comfort that it's not going to be a cookie cutter, do it my way or the highway type thing. It is very specific to the individual, and it, as time goes along, we fit those cardio, the diet, and the training. We switch and switch and fit and fit and fit until we have the perfect combination for the person that is using the, the program.